Ezra Chan saw it. My name is Yazumiya. This is a story about when I was working at Hidegi Interior a few years ago. This is Yuzuriha and Akane. They will start working with you guys today. Please support them. My name is Yuzuriya. Nice to meet you. My name is Akane. Nice to meet you. Phew. I'm so nervous. Hopefully I can do well. I just graduated from high school and I didn't know anything about the real world. I just want to be able to remember work as soon as possible and be a good addition to society. Nice to meet you. My name is Azumi. I'll be training you. Yes, pleased to meet you. Anyways, about your suit, isn't it showing too much of your body? Oh, really? Yeah, especially the breast part. It is tight. I'm sorry. This is my size. Ugh, okay. I don't know who you're trying to seduce, but just please focus on your work. Huh? What does she mean? Is she trying to say that I look slutty? I could take 100 steps back and say that, but why would she say that directly to me? Miss Osmi is supposed to train me, but she is a strange person. But that's not it. Now I'm gonna explain about the hours. This is where we put in our general information. We usually look at it to see how the employees are doing. I see. Hmm? Um, it seems like this employee could have taken 50 more days off. Is that a typo? Huh? That's normal. There's no way people in this industry take two days off. What? But I heard that you get 120 days off a year. <laughs> That's not real, it just says that. In reality, people take a lot less time off. This 50 days off is not accurate either. What? And next... This is not good. What if I accidentally get myself in a really bad company? I started having doubts ever since the beginning and... And ever since then, there has been a lot of things that are at fault in this company as she explained them. What? We don't get bonuses? Of course not! But if we don't say that we do, then no young people are gonna apply, so we have to. Yep, yep! Huh? And in this company, the problem is not only Miss Asami, but... Wow! Miss Yuzuriha, you look cute today, too! We have to have pretty girls in a company! I wanted to get you and Akane in for sure, considering you guys were the prettiest of them all! Ugh. The recruiter Akamatsu even told us about the process, and the CEO Hideki ignores how his workers about the sexual harassment and the powerful harassments. There's no need to feed a fish that we already caught. <laughs> Not only we have to work crazy hours, but we get paid barely anything. Ugh, this is definitely a fail. And ever since I joined, there were so many things that happened that gave me a headache. Good work, Yuzuria. Let's go get lunch. The only thing that's saving me is a situation is Akane. Ugh, don't you think that old lady is so annoying? I just did my nails and she said, who are you trying to seduce? Ugh, how could she even say that? I only do my nails for me. And it's so obvious since she doesn't get any guys, she has to harass me. I would never want to be like that when I get older. <laughs> Same here. Akane isn't the nicest, but she was the only best friend at work that could get me through the day. I understood how depressing it is, but that was the only way we could get rid of this stress. Ah, <sighs> maybe I should start looking for other jobs. But half a year into the company, the only thing that kept me going was about to disappear. Manager! Yesterday's restaurant was amazing! Please invite me again! <laughs> of course! Don't you think they've been acting weird lately? The manager is married! And has kids! Ugh, Akane... It looks like you're friendly with the manager lately. Hmm? Well, probably because we started dating a while ago. Huh? Dating? What are you thinking? He's married. Who cares? It seems like he's done with his wife. And I feel bad that he doesn't have a young pretty girl like me. And look, he bought me this bag. Ugh, don't you feel bad for his wife and his kid? Huh? That doesn't matter. Please, just don't. <sighs> Just because I got it before you did. Ugh. If you keep talking to me like you're better than me, you're gonna one day become like sad old Miss Azumi. Akane. I'm just better at getting along with other people than you. Oh, and I sent you the new job, so please do. Bye. Ugh. Ever since that day, their relationship with Akane all changed. In reality, Akane was supposed to finish this work, but she started dumping her work to me. Thanks again! I told this to the manager and... Ah! 
Akane keeps pushing her work onto you? You're just slow. Akane does her own work. Whenever I told him about Akane, he just had her back. And the most things that added was... Ugh. No matter how hard I try, it never ends. Um, could someone help? Bye! See you tomorrow. Ugh. Everyone was bullying me and nobody was helping me out. I thought it would just be easier for me to transfer, so I looked into it. But everywhere else looks pretty similar. <sighs> I want to quit here as soon as possible, too. But if I quit now, it will show my record that I quit less than three years. If that happens, I wonder if there will be a company that will fire me. <sighs> but for now, I should focus on the job in front of me. I have to go home before the trains stop. Uh. <laughs> huh? What? Perfect. Lights out. See you tomorrow. <sighs> you better be joking. Ugh, I'm done. I'd rather not have a job than to keep working at this shitty company. But I don't just want to quit. That's what they want me to do. I want to get them back for treating me this way. Think, how can I get back at everyone? It can't be something small. What could I do? Ugh. This, this can work. Now this is how I came up with the plan. Except this plan is going to take a little bit more time. I decided to look for a new job and to collect the data I need for the plan. I will get this done no matter what. Into my second year during spring, that's when it happened. Okay then. Yes, this is the Connie from Human Resources. Hello, this is Momiji, the receptionist. There has been a complaint from the company, and they're on the phone. Huh? A complaint? Yes, this is Azumi from Human Resources. Huh? Oh, yes. I'm so sorry. Um, what is this about? Yes, Interior Hidegi. Huh? No, that's... Manager, they won't stop complaining over the phone. Huh? Complaining about what? Um, it's trending on social media saying how this company is toxic. What? Hey, hey! Who could it be? Who would spread a rumor so stupid? Oh, Yuzuria's not here yet! Why is she not here?! I don't know. She's not answering her phone. Manager! What?! I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but... It's your wife on the phone, and she said that she wants to talk to you about the affair. Uh, what?! <laughs> I've decided to quit Interior Hidegi and decided to go back to my hometown. I threw away a month of payment, and I switched my address and my phone number after I told the entire world about the affair and how toxic the company is. Meaning this is what I did. A few weeks ago... Huh? You want to interview the new people? Yes, everyone seems busy. Oh, then yes, could you? Nobody wants to do it, so, uh... Oh, right, right! She lives close to the company, so we're not going to pay for her transportation fees. But tell her that we'll pay for it anyways to her. Well, if she decided to show me a good time, I could change that, but... <laughs> Ugh, I understand. So I was successful in getting in contact with the interviewers and the day of the interview. Thank you so much for choosing Interior Hidegi. No, thank you. Ugh, Miss Kalrin. Why did you think you were picked by us? Huh? Uh, I don't know. I feel like that's none of my business. You were... Picked because her manager thought from human resources that you were attractive. Huh? Uh, what does that mean? By the way, the human resources manager is having an affair with one of my co-workers. Huh? And if you don't do sexual favors for the manager, they won't pay for your transportation fee. Huh? All of these departments seem like they're having similar problems. But if you want to do well in the human resources department, the only way to do well is to get on the manager's good side. Also... It says that you have 120 days off in a year, but in reality, it's less than 50 days. If I can take a day off in a week, that's my lucky week. I work overtime all the time, and it's normal to not be able to make the last train. No bonuses, and they don't even pay us well. Also, it's a company that has sexual and power harassment, especially towards the newbies. So, I think it's in your best interest to leave this company. It's not too late for you. You're still a student. I strongly advise that you don't join this company and try again with a different one. Ugh. Thank you for your warning. I'm going to check and do some research and think about resigning. Yes, of course. Oh, and this is not covered by the company, so I'll get it. Huh? No, if that's the case, I'd like to pay for it myself. No, no. I only have a few days left in the company, so... Ugh. 
And during the other interviews, I told everyone the same thing. As a result, Professor! What's going on, Karin? I had an interview with a company yesterday. Students with sense of justice, fear, and interest told other students about what happened. I was about to join a horrible company! Really? How come? Thanks to them, Interior Hidegi was known for its true self. And that's how I'm in this position. <laughs> Everyone should be super confused by now. I sent them my letter of resignation a few days later, and there's one more thing. Ah, she's really outdone herself! How could she?! Excuse me, we're the police. Huh? You must be Miss Ozumi from Human Resources. Yes? I have a warrant for your arrest for embezzlement. You'll be coming with me. What? What? To be honest, I knew about Ozumi's embezzlement for a while now. She was on really good terms with the financial people, and I actually saw them making deals, so I collected some evidence and gave it to the police. <laughs> it was all worth it. I have already had a job lined up at a company near my hometown. I didn't tell them all the details of why I quit, but they generally knew the idea of it, so they were feeling sympathy towards me. Later on, Akane tried bullying me on social media, but... Now I'm to pay consolation money to the wife because of her! That bitch! I looked at the comments and no one felt sorry for her. Don't blame her because you got caught, you bitch! As a result, she stopped posting on social media. <laughs> That's what you get. The last two years was hell, but I'm doing well at the company I'm working at now. The CEO loved the plan that you came up with, Miss Yuzuriha. Very good! Oh, really? I'm so glad. That's because I had your help, Mr. Kuroki. No, no, it was all you. The first company I worked for was a horrible company, but... I got back at them and I'm gonna try to move on. On the other hand... Boss! If we keep going at this rate, we're not gonna have a company! <laughs> then fire the workers! We'll have fewer people work for us, and that should help! Boss! We don't have any employees we can spare! Boss! We're gonna quit at the end of this month! Me too! Me too! Uh, someone help me! ご視聴いただきありがとうございました! 会社の利益、自分がいい思いをするためだけのことしか考えられないのはどうなんでしょうかね。結局、会社は人間が集まっているわけですし、仕事も大事ではありますが、人間は案外脆い生き物なのですから、休みも与えられないような職場はありえないです